So guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Matt, I review running shoes here on YouTube, and today we're looking at the new Adidas Supernova solution. Now, so far the Adidas Supernova line, which started with the Supernova Rise, has been wildly popular, and now we introduce the stability shoe of the Supernova line. All right, let's get into it. Let's get started off with those disclosures. This video is in cooperation with my friends over at Roadrunner Sports. Roadrunner Sports was good enough to send me this pair of the Supernova solution for the purpose of review. However, they haven't told me what to say, they don't have any editorial privileges, and all the thoughts and opinions are my own. With that said, you can pick up a pair of the Adidas Supernova solution at Roadrunner Sports for $140. So right off the bat, the price is right in line where we would expect a shoe like this. It's a well-cushioned daily trainer, but as I said, it's got some stability elements, but we'll get to that in just a minute. The Supernova solution has the same stack height as the Supernova Rise. We have 36 millimeters in the heel, 26 millimeters in the forefoot for a 10 millimeter drop. Adidas claims that a US men's size 9 would tip the scale at 10.3 ounces or 292 grams. However, in my size, a US men's size 13, the Supernova Solution tips the scale at 12.5 ounces or 354 grams. So as we do, let's get started at the top and work our way down. I will hold this up so you can see that heel collar. It's nicely padded, my friends. It's a very plush heel collar and the step and feel of the Supernova Solution feels exactly how this heel collar looks nice and plush the heel counter is very rigid again as we would expect in a daily trainer and i did get a good heel lockdown i didn't experience any heel slip in the supernova solution the upper is an engineered mesh it kind of feels quite thick to me which is a good thing because it feels very high quality it feels like it's going to lock down your foot very well but i certainly question the breathability in the hottest summer months but i do have to say that in my testing of this shoe when it hasn't been summertime i haven't experienced any issues with breathability and i do live in Florida so I have been testing their shoes in fairly warm weather just not the extremes of summer. Now the tongue is nice and thickly padded there's a lot of cushion here now the tongue is not gusseted but we do have a single lace loop right on the top. Now the laces work very well they're really nothing to mention other than I got a good lockdown they didn't slip through the eyelets and really I had no issues with them. There is an additional hole in case you need to do the lace lock method but I didn't have to as I already said I did get a good heel lock in the solution. Now as far as overlays and underlays go we do have an underlay coming around the toe box we've got the three stripes on the lateral and medial side and then we just got that support coming along the eyelid chain just so you can really cinch down those laces. Now the three striped logos on each side are just giving support to that upper but on the medial side we do have an extra overlay it's very difficult to see because it's black on a black upper but it's kind of like a half moon shape right here and again that's just providing a little extra support so that upper stands up makes it easy for your foot to go in and I imagine it's giving a little lateral support for when you're running to keep your foot from sliding around but more on that in a minute. We've also got this extra overlay right on the back but honestly that's not doing anything that's more just to place a little reflective branding on the back that internal heel counter is very rigid so this little overlay isn't doing much okay let's come down to the midsole now the midsole in the supernova line is quite exciting it's adidas's new dream strike plus midsole now this is a super critical piba based foam now i do have to caution you that the dream strike plus is not as plush and soft as some other piba foams that you may have run in and then i just want to show you the bottom of the shoe we do have the support rod systems which you can see here in gray and now that you can see this coming from the heel reaching all the way up into the forefoot and now that I've pointed out the gray support rods on the bottom if I turn the shoe back on its side you can see this gray foam coming around all the way around to the other side so really the supernova solution is a dual density midsole we have the dream strike plus which is piba and then we have the support rods which is a much firmer EVA foam now I point at this and I call it the support rods this is not part of the support rods the support rods are bottom loaded and this is what you see here but it is the same EVA foam now a key difference between this the supernova solution and the neutral version of the supernova which is this the supernova rise is the amount of energy rod foam that they're including so if i show you the bottom of the supernova rise we can see a very similar support rod system but when i hold it up to the side there isn't as much visible so the support rods are much thinner on the supernova rise on the solution adidas has added onto this support rod system and they've added more firmer eva and that is the main stability element in the solution coming back to the bottom for a second adidas is using their adiwear outsole rubber and it is a full cover rubber we do have this area in the middle that looks like it doesn't have any rubber but it does the rubber is just clear here and i gotta say the adiwear outsole rubber on the supernova solution is holding up remarkably well it is very difficult for me to see anywhere at all but 
something I do want to point out to you, which is I think is a nice design, especially for heel strikers, is this heel bevel. Now Adidas has included a laterally biased heel bevel right here, and it's quite pronounced, right? And I find that when I'm running easy and I am a heel striker, I find it very pleasant to land on this lateral heel and just roll through my gait cycle. However, I did find the ride in the Supernova Solution fairly firm, and that's due to a couple of things. I think mainly it's due to the increased amount of this EVA foam that they're using, but also I think this outsole rubber is contributing to that firmer feeling as I roll through the shoe. Now I should tell you that I did think that the Supernova Rise was also a fairly firm ride, but definitely not as firm as the Supernova Solution. So clearly, at least clear to me because I've run in both shoes, the main element that is making it a firm ride is this amount of EVA foam on the bottom. However, it's far from being too firm and the shoe rides very comfortable when you're using it for how it's supposed to be used, which is a daily trainer, you know, those miles where you're just going out to get the miles in. I think it is firm enough where it can encourage faster paces, but for me, the only time when I picked up the pace in the Supernova Solution was when I was doing strides at the end of an easy run. This would not be my choice to go out and run intervals or to run a tempo run. Also, because of the firmness of the midsole, I probably wouldn't choose this shoe to go out for recovery runs. But that's not to take anything away from the Supernova Solution. I think it fits nicely in the bracket where it's made to fit, and that's as a daily trainer. The shoe that you are just going to pile tons and tons of miles into. Okay, now it's your turn. I want to hear from you. What are your thoughts on the Adidas Supernova line so far? Have you been tempted to pick up a pair of the Supernova Rise? Or have you been waiting for the stability version, the Supernova Solution? Let me know in the comments. Oh, and of course, I will place a link to this in the show notes below in case you want to pick up a pair for yourself from Roadrunner Sports. And I would just like to ask if you found this video entertaining or informational, consider subscribing and drop a like on the video. And with that, it's Matt B. This has been my review of the Adidas Supernova Solution. Be kind, be happy, run well. I'll see you in a couple of days. Thank you.